Reading for The Hammer today is March 10th, 2012. I saw the movie War Horse the other day. When I saw this movie's trailer, I thought, it looks, it looks good. I thought it looked good. No, that's right. I thought it looked good. I thought it was too good to miss. This movie also received Oscar Award nominations. And Steven Spielberg is the director of this movie. There is no reason why not to run up to the theater. I look I looked forward to seeing this movie. Maybe I was looking more natural. I was looking forward mm. to seeing this movie. As as I expected, it, I was really impressed. It's about a young horse that experiences many hardships throughout the war, throughout a war. Through this horse's experiences, this movie expresses the bloodiness of war. In the beginning of this movie, there is a beautiful scenery in the field. A baby horse is born on a farm. He has been living happily with his mother, who obviously loves him. Well, he lives. He lives happily with his mother, who obviously loves him. After the horse is a little older, it is sold to plow the farm of a poor farmer. The farmer's son takes care of him and trains him with a lot of love. The horse is a thoroughbred and is not, you, and is not originally for plowing. But this horse is not a normal thoroughbred horse at all. But this horse is not a normal thoroughbred horse at all. He is so strong that he can plow even when the ground is hard and rocky. After, the horse, after that, the horse makes more miracles happen. One day, a great war starts. The horse is forced to, uh, by the military to go to war as a war horse. His mir miraculous life starts. His miraculous life starts. Many miraculous things happen during the war. A British soldier and a German soldier become friends thanks to Joey. I want you to see this movie at the theater for sure. Again, this movie was really good. The end.